Well, hello guys. This is me, Christian, again. And of course, guys, here we most likely get going in our 2,259 free-for-all match gameplay, guys. And all that kind of stuff. Anyways, guys, if any of you guys have mainly not subscribed to my channel or my girlfriend Harmony's channel, mainly please consider doing so, guys. And yeah, well, also, guys, let me know in the comments down below if any of you guys are interested in my War Robots free for gameplays, guys, of who's going to maybe win this round. If it might be me or any of the random enemy players. One way is to find out for sure. And who knows how many, wait, what number enemy players there will be considered. Because if... Because I don't have a specific enemy name on my own. So we spot enemy 3, enemy 2. There's probably enemy 1 somewhere. Yeah, that was enemy 6 destroyed, so I'm probably like enemy 4 or whatever. Enemy 4 or 5. Something like that. Anyways... Let me just fly all across the map, guys. How much more fun can this all go? Make it totally worth it for the flight of it all. Ooh, a scorpion. How clever, trying to attack me so soon, huh? Never rush into situations like this, especially if we get an atomic explosion like that. Boom! Scorpion definitely got roasted right there for sure. Oh, dear. Wouldn't I just like to put an edit right there for a sunglasses emote? Or whatever. Mission of respect. Always respect the great players of all times. So this was just the beginning of the match. And I thought I was going to lose control of my entire robot right there. But nope, the Fafnir still won that first kill. Speaking of which, this player at Kepri... Kepri is so AFK at the moment. Let me just go ahead and kill him quickly. Either he's experiencing internet issues or he had to go do something. He or she, doesn't matter. Yo, that guy's right in the flight mode once again. Try to kill the angler. And there we go, the angler robot is destroyed by me personally. Yeah. Whoa. I'm gonna target for this player first of all, because he looks close for one, and the other thing is I didn't want him to receive another ability that quickly. There is, I guess, the pursue harpy here. Man, he seemed close. I can still catch him in the act. Don't worry, guys. I'll make it worth it. Totally. Totes. Worth it all. Oh, boy. Just realizing the typhoon now. Don't want to get EMP'd by him anytime soon. It's 3.3 of that robot. Perfect timing to waste my time right there. Well, my robot is now going to nearly get destroyed by this guy. So I'm going to have to try my best to circle, maybe to try to get around him. It's kind of hard dodging around this guy. Especially if rockets can fall for some reason. Uh, I was close to winning that. Well, I'm coming back with another one of those spots. And time to get my pesky revenge here on this behemoth that tried to kill me before. And here's the best part. I'm gonna completely ignore your Aegis Shield. Even though you got two times the amount of Aegis Shields, is no point if I can just do this all over again, right? Look at that, barely even da any damage token. Yo! Called upon another behemoth. Things are gonna suck now. Being stuck between a lot of players. Or being fourth, or whatever. I'm certainly gonna be killing you all now, little behemoth. Here's 
the party time of town now. So far, I've been taking a lot of robots on, as it is. Still, mainly punching the guy a bit. Here's why, like, even with the target malfunction, yeah, well, this guy's a bigger target. Titans usually often tend to be a bigger target than the smaller, normal robots, I should say. That's why it makes it a bit more easier that way. So it doesn't matter what you try to do. Well, I've got my Titan now finally ready, so... Might as well make the counter a bit worth it for this entire round. That's gotta be one of the easiest Titan Slayers in history yet. Oop, la la, here we go. See ya later! Whatever that robot was just in. Took dead toast now. I might as well just do everything I can to get my clips of ammo reloaded fast. And now let's start attacking this guy, because this guy's definitely the bigger threat as it is here. And he just instantly killed my target that I wanted to kill. Oh well. That's the model trying to reload again. And perfect timing to get suppressed too, while I'm reloading my weapons again. Now that's really coming in handy, it's worth it. Yo, another very good target on hand. <laughs> Another great, crazy one. Should have maybe Blastoise to at least take the shield down, because then I could have maybe won the fight. I guess I'm Blastoise with him now, and now he's instantly gone in his ability. Oh, darn. And no matter how much I tried to break for that shield, I definitely did nothing about it, for sure. Now I'm going to try to Orion strike this guy now. Sub Scorpion came in at a convenience. Laughing his feet off or whatever. Yo, getting him close. I'm going to try my best to back away. And now it's slowing down because of... The DM effect of the Northern Lights. Whatever that came from, like the little lasers or whatever. Man, a lot of these are good for a lot of work, I say. So, guys. Another one, here it is. Lava! Instantly destroyed like now. Here comes another target just to basically destroy at this point. And would you look at that? Obviously it has to be another big emit. So let's just kill him quickly. Get this part out of the way or whatever, right? Okay, the R for... No, wait. The A for robot. Darn, we're not going to stand at any good chances of this guy here now. Well, Scorpion's going to chase after him. Gonna maybe try to wait... Until he teleports back. And wow. Alliteration. Way to go to nothing land. The guy is so scary to take down. I don't know if I can take him on. Boy. Well, he's just about to steal my kill right there. No, sorry. You cannot just right there. 
know what? I basically risked so much already. I've taken so many enemies, tried taking so many enemies down. I might as well just try to do something here. Make it worth my shot. I'm gonna start acting my good age here. Time to attack. Give it everything I got. Yes! And the money boss does it, guys. Yeah. Sometimes, when there's bigger enemies nearby, you just gotta uh, know when to be the tough guy here. And the, you may not be so big yourself, but your actions are a lot more bigger than their ginormous size. I just proven how tough I can be worthy out in that battle, guys. And I gotta say, guys, that's 4.2 million. I'll give a great speech here. Anyways, so everybody basically did a good job here. Wonderful. Got a very good experience out of this. I enjoyed every incredible moment there is. And you know what? I'm just realizing I'm done with this speech now. I'm done with all this for tonight. Anyways, now Christian signing off. Bye-bye. Yeah, have a nice one.